Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and it's been a very long time since I posted anything here so hi, my name is Joy. I do fashion and lifestyle and things and yeah, it's been a while. So this is my very first vlog. I'm trying to condense. I, I shot quite a bit in a long period of time. Um, I got sick. It was just a whole thing. I'll explain in like a few other vlogs, um, especially with the travel vlog. But anyways, this is my first vlog. It's just a con like a condensed version of what I was up to two months ago, so enjoy. Anyways, it is Sunday evening and there is a huge bag that I've been needing to go through. Um, it's a shopping haul, I guess, if you want to call it that. I basically... <laughs> there's a lot of stuff that I've been needing to restock in the house or replace or whatever and just generally buy. And I went on Jumia and I bought everything and everything arrived like five days ago. Like it's a huge haul. <laughs> and it's 100% paid by me. This is not sponsored. Um, and I need to go through it. Anyway, so what I'm going to do is go through everything. And if I find anything that I think you guys might be interested in, I will talk to you guys about it. I think that's the best way to go at it. Um, I'm going to need a pair of scissors. All right, I've gone through everything. I genuinely forgot half the stuff that I bought. There's nothing like crazy sexy that's happening in my bag. Like, it's literally things that I needed. I needed a new jug. Got a jug. Needed a huge water bottle because I lost my other one that was like half this size. So this is perfect. I think I got, yeah, 2,000 milliliters. My goal will be to be doing at least two of these per day. So this is fantastic I'll be putting the links for some of these things but like literally I didn't get anything like this. like I needed new makeup brushes a new makeup uh, brush organizer like gems for my hair I got skincare my Guardian Neutrogena um, products yeah and I needed to restock them so I had to get a bunch of that um, I got my hair stuff oh hangers these I am mad excited about. These are for um, pants, so you can be able to hang like up to four pairs of jeans or trousers or shorts on one hanger, so that your like closet doesn't get too packed. Which I'm very, and I got a, I got a lot of them. Like I think I have 15 of these, which is kind of a lot, but we need them. God, I'm old. <laughs> Like things. I thought I got like some crazy fun stuff. I genuinely forgot. I'm just like, oh yeah. I mainly bought like combs and things. Hello guys. I'm getting ready for an event. I'll explain once I get there. Just need to quickly shove a bunch of nose rings up my nose. <laughs> um I'm doubling up. So these are actually from Fleet No. These are from Beauty Galore on Instagram. I'll put their link down below. Um, Cause I've tried, like the coily ones just don't be working with my nose so I've given up on that. So I just put like the regular nose rings nowadays. And then I'm putting also a septum ring but the little tiny itty bitty one which of course means mama needs pliers. You guys remember this from my TZ vlog so I gotta and Dan's gonna be here in like three minutes so I gotta do this quickly gotta open it up till it's wide enough to where it can fit up the nose take the plier so this is just like a jewelry plier you can find them either on Jumia or you can find them okay I find these on Jumia so and I think I'm gonna do a dark lip some gold earrings Oh. oh my god, Phil, like your Bluetooth thing is very uh, annoying. I'll check it out. Babe, I'm putting on nose ring, please. Me too. Like, back up. Just let me kiss your pig head. <laughs> no, go away. Go away. <clears throat> Was that comfortable to wear? Nope. But do we convince ourselves that we're okay? Yeah. And so I think I need to like make my own nose rings because man, I struggle with these fake ones. There. Fits. I think I need to make it tighter though. 
then I'm putting on my lippy, which is the MAC Cosmetics Uniformly Fabulous. I've just put a little bit of powder on my lips to just, it kind of helps the lipstick last longer. All right, I am dressed. The dark lip. And then my outfit of the day. Ignore this wall. It's been through life and back. We had a leakage that entered into our wall that entered into our wallpaper. Adulting sucks. But I look adorable. Thank you. We have been in traffic for over an hour and a half. We are so over it. And guess who chose the route? Her. Everybody knows I did not choose the route. You know this. <laughs> It was him. And I was like, see, we use the inner roads. Like, oh, no, trust me. The way they are so fast. Ah. I don't know why you sound like a bubba in my head, but you do. But everyone Anyways. is coming in right now. Yeah, because we're all on the same damn traffic. <laughs> we're all just behind each other in one long ass line. Anyways, to me, Fika. Tell me now, tell me something. Because I don't know how this going to end. Yesterday was fun. We partied. I got home at one. Yo, what is that to use them things? Huh? It's crazy late for me. So what we were celebrating yesterday with EABL and Tanqueray and everybody was the bar. So it's gonna be an online platform where you can, or it is, actually it's already launched. It is an online platform where you can order drinks from anywhere and it can be delivered to your house within 20 to 40 minutes um, whatever you're into whether it's ciders beers gin uh, vodka whatever you're into it'll be delivered to your house so that's what that launch was um, and right now I am getting ready for a lunch in our house actually dinner in the house uh, we're having a few friends over it's almost like 10 people um we're having a few friends over for vibes and chillaxing and just having a good time and they should be getting here from four and i am just trying to make myself look good for uh, visitors so i've literally just thrown on a little bit of concealer and i'm just like warming it into the skin just under my eyes that's the only place I put it and I'm just gonna pull powder that's it cuz I'm in the house like why do I need to have a full B phase and we got time for that so that is what is happening I basically woke up this morning cleaned up the entire house we organized everything you know how like even if your house is clean when you have people coming over you like re-clean the clean things just so that it's like spotless <laughs> so that's what I've been doing the entire morning um and i was able to actually work out which i'm super excited about and i'm very proud of myself um what else i think i'm gonna throw on some blush just for a little bit of cola because i know i'm wrong with a little bit of color and then i'm gonna do my brows and then that's gonna be it and then some setting spray and then that's gonna be it and then for my lippy i like to mix two different things so this is a maybelline superstay matte ink 
part of their coffee collection. So this is the Chai Genius and then the Mocha Inventor. And what I usually like to do to create my perfect nude is to place it onto the hand like that. Just a little bit of the product that you need. So for the lighter one, I put a little, like I, I put quite a bit. And then for this darker shade, I literally just put like a drop like that. See that? And then I just warm it up with my hands, slowly just mixing the two products together. And then you apply it. And I just take my lip gloss. This is Reflector lip gloss. I think I got this from Beauty Click. Actually, just go white into my office. What's up, boo boo kitties? Me and my man's had a small little gathering with a few people. Tell me how I shot nothing. Like, why did I even bother? <laughs> like, I was hosting a lot, so I just, I, there was no way for me to make sure everybody was fed, had drinks in their hands, uh, making sure everybody had everything that they needed, and also do this. There was just no way. Because um, I'm the hostess with the mostess. Uh, yeah, so I am shooting right now. I'm gonna try to figure out how to do a nice smoky eye. Usually my smoky eyes are usually very, um, not neat. So we're gonna try to needify it. Make it, why is my laptop not charging? The plug this in. Anyways, yeah, so that's what we're doing today. And then we're doing fashion, clothing, makeup, transitions, the whole shebang, bang, bang. Um, cause I really want to get back to the old content that I used to do. Like, can we just, like, do you see how extra I used to be? Like, I used to be so extra. I mean, it also helped that we're in the middle of a pandemic, so there was nowhere that we were going. So this is all I had to do to entertain myself. But I was so extra and I was having so much fun with these things. And then I just kind of started getting comfortable and just started doing get ready with me videos. Which are, I think they're fine, but that can't be all. Like, I do, I do, I do some crazy stuff. Like, I can do some fun things. So we're getting back to that. And I've already started, I did a whole video on um, different ways to rock one corset top, this one. Check it out on my Instagram, she is fire, she is hot. Um, and we're doing more transitions basically today. So let me do the first half of the first transition and it's for that Nicki Minaj song. This is messy, let's see. After all that surgery, he was still messy. Wait. No, that's not how the song goes. This is Matt C. Let's see. After all that surgery, you were still... No. I need to figure out these lyrics before I do this video. Oh, and before I start, before someone's just like, oh my god, that song is so vulgar. Why are you guys calling women ugly? Nobody's calling anybody ugly. It's just a fun song transition so I can be like, ooh, no makeup to ooh, beat face. Calm down, please. Wait a minute. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. There's some people who really like to reach and find issues, Jesus. First, I am getting the song together. I like to use my laptop and a professional camera to do all of my shooting and editing because I've spent a lot of money on these things. Why would I not use it and just use my phone editor, please? Anybody got time for that? You can, but if you already own all these things, use them. Otherwise, it's a waste of money. Tell me now. I just need to have my lunch actually ordered because I haven't cooked oops so I need to order my lunch now as I figure out my other outfits for my outfit video all right so makeup video done I'm doing an outfit video my favorite all black looks in my closet this is one of them this is a jumpsuit that I got thrift for 100 bucks it's so long it's flared it's just vibes on vibes Best hundred bob ever spent. We love her. We love her. Maybe I am too naive, but I'm choosing to believe that you will give me another chance. Oh, whoa. so tell me now. 
Hi, let's get ready for an event. It is a morning event, and I'm wearing this very cute dress from Hikaya, so let's put something together. Also, I have less than five minutes because the event starts at 8, and it is 8.30. So here's the dress. So to create a little bit of shape, all I'm going to do is take the straps, pull it around, cross it, and then bring it back, and then just quickly tie a bow. Cool. All right, shoes. For shoes, I'm thinking a little pop of color with these pink strappy heels and then this bag. So I kept it quite simple with the hair. I just put up these corners, left this part out and put them up with a little gemmed hair clip and then threw on some pink earrings because why not? They're adorable and they go with the shoes. And here is the full look. Cute, simple, can go with me through the entire day till evening. Adorable. Me like you. Alright, let's go. <laughs> On the Instagram, eh. but you too. I've lost it. I mean, I lost it. All in the middle. Hold on. Shh. I swear. Hang out with women and vlogging is impossible. Oh, yes. <laughs> Hold on. So, yeah. what I was saying was, so we were at the launch for the new brand ambassador, the new face of Nice and Lovely, and it was Kay, and that was happening. I could not say anything because of copyright music and things. But the ladies are here. Kate has to get out of her gown. <laughs> Somewhere. <laughs> It's the fan for me. Yeah. <laughs> the fact that I'm not in that frame. And she's giving birth like anytime next month, which also means like it could be even today. Now, like the baby's ready. And have you ever just met a chick who has FOMO? Like she refuses to just sit on her lily pad and just be pregnant and barefoot in the kitchen. So just like vibes. What is the kitchen? I belong. I belong in the streets yes. of Nairobi and showing off outfits. That's my true. No. Hey. Anyways, so the thing started at eight. I showed up at nine thirty. I'm not. I'm not good at eight. Apparently, these people were on time. No. 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 No, no ma'am. Oh. At nine. We got okay, nine, so nine, I'm not 30. crazy. Yeah. You okay, I tried. I really, my heart was in the right place. <laughs> but then I woke up, and then I went on TikTok for like 45 minutes. Wow. <laughs> then I took a shower. <laughs> then I was just like, ah, what am I wearing? <laughs> then I had to iron. Then I looked at the time it was nine. Then I was like, I need to go. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. So when my Wimby having a drink, she's having juice. <laughs> I have to say that. I imagine I have to say that because the yeah, internet is so stupid. This yeah, one is like, actually, your friend is having drinks with people. Yeah. 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 Relax. Yeah. Yeah. Relax. Yeah. Relax. I said she has full mode. She's not an idiot. <laughs> you look at me like I'm crazy when I shut my feelings out. You look at me like I'm different. Still you stay cause you feel something real Get so lost in my moments Doesn't mean I don't need you I, I, I. Hey guys Um So I forgot what I'm saying I'm getting ready for lunch My cousin's on the way to pick an outfit <coughs> Cause apparently I'm the wardrobe Lady I don't know what to tell you uh, we're going to social house. I started off wanting to look like a Gatsby chick. Then I started putting on these gold pieces. Then before I knew it, I got a septum ring and a nose ring. So we're changing up the entire look. And I don't know what I'm going to wear. But I'm thinking a bodysuit. So let me just... Yeah. Bodycon romper. Let me first put it on and we see. That only sounds then. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I have put on this onesie. It is a bodycon romper, some sneaks because we extra, and I'm gonna throw on a denim jacket. One second. 
Okay, go away. And you just go the entire tire. ironing board. It's fine. It's fine. Disrespect from your younger cousins. And then I throw it on the denim jacket. I'm carrying these sunnies because I want to act like I am 21 and those cool girls who wear sunglasses indoors. I'm not going to. It's literally just for vibes. And then I have my Denry bag. Ugh, so hot. You can borrow mine. Since I do wear sunnies. Babe, I don't wear sunnies. It's, it's such a vibe. It's, a vibe. It's, it's part of my outfit. Like, yeah, the nose ring. The, it, yeah. You get what I'm yes. going for? Yes, like 21-year-old? Yes, yes, yes. Like who for some weird reason always have enough money to go to school? Me, when did 21-year-olds get money? <laughs> like when did 21-year-olds get money? Like the level of broke that we can we come. Guys, we're so good. Even in the frame, you're in the frame. Damn. I'm the, the amount of money that we did not have in our twenties that y'all all of a sudden have is mm. shocking. Buying houses and shit. Not even buying houses. Like when you just not even buy like I don't, I don't okay, I personally don't know any like twenty year olds who's buying a house and no, you've seen them on TikTok like being like keys, just got my phone. Oh no, you're talking it's about so the cool. American ones. Oh not Kenyan. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm talking about the American ones who make like seven thousand dollars on yeah. Instagram posts. Of course they'll be able to buy houses. I'm yeah, talking I'm about that. Kenyan ones mm. who are at like Mercury or Social House and I'm just like me and my friends used to go to Mwendas when we wanna spoil ourselves. Y'all got money. Y'all got some money. Anyway, yeah. For you. So this is my outfit of the day. Oh detail shot. Oh and please don't judge the background. I know it's messy. I'm in the process of cleaning it. Anyway, so we got a septum ring, nose ring. Some a little ghetto gold earrings that say bad gale. A necklace. I'm kind of going for like that whole like Brooklyn aesthetic. You know what I'm saying? Like who, the, who you who you think you're talking to? That's my aesthetic. Anyways, yeah. So hmm, I'll see you guys later. Bye. kind of tell me what I'm thinking. I fell in love with the way we are and the way we lose it. There's something different about us. the way we are It is a must for the day because I'm really trying to get back on to the healthier version of me wagon. I have been struggling so bad this past, like I know I keep saying this I'm struggling, but I'm genuinely struggling. Like I'm genuinely struggling just because of schedules and everything. And I've been traveling a lot these past three weeks and just a lot has been happening. So I've not meal prepped easily in like a month, which is bad. Yeah, an update, I've also not lost weight. <laughs> All right, so I've already done majority of everything. I have packed up all of my smoothie bags. I have prepped majority of my veggies, which are all in here. And y'all know I love to air fry. Um, this is my tofu for my lunch wraps, um, some fish for my dinners, and some prawns also for my dinners. I am going to be freezing some of these. I'm going to go till next week, but then whatever I'm going to eat this week is going to be put in the fridge. Not to be like them. Them. We fly around like paper planes. They never know where we will fall. Nobody can see us still there.
this is one of the best tofus I've ever made. Like it's nicely crunchy. I didn't have to put any um, flour or anything on top. Just marinated it for like 20 minutes. Nice and dry. It has really good texture. Crunchy on the outside. Proud of myself. Like I've made tofu a lot of times, but every single time it's always like I have to try out a different recipe, and I've and I've just tried a bunch of different things until I think I finally figured it out, which is exciting. Cause tofu is just such a if you do not understand tofu and you know our culture is not so much into the tofu lifestyle it's such a good luck hope you figure it out type of thing i don't know but i think i'm figuring it out all my dinners are done these are my lunches for the week and voila meal prep good morning i am going on a staycation it's half work, half staycation, so I'm gonna be working today and chilling tomorrow and hanging out with the man's thing. And then, yeah, so let me make my breakfast real quick and then we move on. There's something different about the way we are. garlic bread with boiled egg and um, sun-dried tomato pesto that I made but I pre-made it yesterday because I was afraid that I didn't have time today so I had to warm it in the toaster and usually I put greens on top but I already packed the greens because I have basically packed 98% of all the meals I'm gonna be having I'm trying not to eat out anymore um, maybe once a week um, and I'm gonna be working out this evening so yeah oh and I've put my entire meals all the way down to the weight in my Yazio app. Hashtag not sponsored, but hashtag I love this app. Um, it helped me in the beginning lose the 13 kgs, so it should be able to help me lose the seven that I need to lose. So, mm, and this is approximately like 370 calories. So I'm back to counting calories. I've just discovered after losing the weight the first time, I got comfortable and I started talking about like, oh, I'll start doing intuitive eating, blah, 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 blah. And I've started following so many people who have kind of also been in like fitness journey, weight loss journey. And a lot of them are just like, yeah, I fucked up as soon as I thought that I could be able to do intuitive eating. So I'm that person. I cannot do intuitive eating. So I'm just going to have to stick to weighing my meals and knowing how many calories I'm taking in and how many calories, calories I'm taking out. Because my intuition ain't when it comes to food. Because I will eat everything and everything. And so I'm just wrap up and we head out. Hey guys, so I'm here at Somerset. Ooh, my face is so shiny and that lighting ain't doing it. Okay, so I'm here at Somerset Westview. It's not open yet, but it's going to be opening on Wednesday. By the time this video is up, it's actually going to be open. And I'm here to shoot and Mohai is here to help me. Mo dizzle in the schnizzle. Yes. Yeah, I'm trying to do as much content as humanly possible, and it is possible if you have help. Um, so I first need to unpack. I literally packed every single meal I am going to be having, and no, this is not cake. Before you think that it's salads, um, just leftovers that we had in the house, and then I have every single meal already planned out, and I just need to put it in the fridge. Roasted veggies, I got soup. Doing this. I haven't packed everything because y'all know how I like to roll. Oh, is that me? Okay. Hey, girl. Um, yeah, so let me just show you guys around. So I got the two bedroom. Y'all know I love staying in two bedrooms, especially because I travel with all my equipment. I just like my stuff being in a separate room where I can get ready in there and all that. And then the schmanz is coming later, and I don't want him to like have to deal with like my clothing mess and equipment and everything so let me show you guys around so from the door we have the kitchen area has everything that you need stove top um oven there's even a dishwasher in here which is fantastic i have unpacked every single meal that i brought with me including even a boiled egg um and then here is the living space absolutely adorable we love it 
and then through here I have the master suite my working area where I'll be editing view from the window and then there's also a walk-in closet through here and then the bathroom and if you go down this area I love big mirrors because I like to see my outfits <laughs> uh, first this is the other bedroom with the twin beds and I literally have unpacked everything y'all know how it rolls ignore the lighting shower bath and also a dishwasher oh that's not a dishwasher sorry washing machine washing machine good morning day two i know the lighting is crazy we're shooting with moham i'm having quick brekkie brekkie i got the english breakfast you know the usual bacon sausage beans mushrooms eggs battery dying all right let me switch batteries all right so i have changed we're just doing some vlog not vlogging sorry huh okay anyways so we're just shooting some content right now for tank array i changed into this outfit i need to get back to work Moha. Is over there. <laughs> okay okay let's make sure you guys the actual outfit properly but yeah she's okay vibes you fucked up no consistency here whatsoever so we're having sundowner drink. Okay, the sun has gone down. Also, I'm doing the same thing. Okay, so she started taking photos now. I was trying. After the sun has already gone down. I don't know what her plan and strategy was, but it is what it is. Uh, so we just had a few drinks and we're heading down for dinner. We did a whole outfit change. This is the outfit. I'm not standing up. Y'all get it. It's you get cute. what you get. You get what you get when you get it. And you say, thanks, mom. Can I please have another? So yeah, then we're going to go down for dinner. And then it's a good way to wrap up a Sunday. I think so. Nice and relaxed. Bye. Ha. Huh. Good morning. Um, I am wrapped. Everything is packed, ready to go. Um, I have to go to work now, like more work. It just, it's a Maybelline thing. You'll see. You'll see. But I'm out. <laughs> so I need to go downstairs and check out. Okay, Maybelline stuff. Here you Maybelline. <laughs> Maybelline people, we are delivering these. These beautiful things, yeah. There you go. To guys. Uh, Sharon, Aziad, and Maposha. We're going to Sharon. We did Aziad. I forgot to record. Because I forgot. Okay. Ooh, there's something different about us. Is here. Hello. Hi. How are you, honey? Wait, do people sometimes still call you This Is Us? Oh yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh okay. yeah. I literally had that like a week ago, and I was like, I just did a, I just did the real talking about like. Oh, you don't names. like you're different. I am. Yeah. She's so Sharon. Many. But it's okay. I it's honestly fine. like yeah. I'll answer to Esther, Esmeralda. <laughs> I'll say all the S's. I'm your yes. And sometimes it's like, what? No, not you. I'm like, oh, sorry. Just joking. So we just dropped off the lip glosses to her no, it, this is the lip gloss this yeah is it. so this I is actually it. like it's super find portable a bag. yeah exactly and it's very portable yeah yeah which is normal size type stuff yeah. here that name maybe do big go big <laughs> or go home hi okay so i'm going to meet the side i'm here with wowzy we're doing a master a master commercial crony master class uh, for content creation i'm going to be talking about my process and everything um number two outfit of the day let me just show you the video because Again, y'all know me. Uh, so this is what I'm wearing. Okay, let's put together a look today. So I have a master class that I am hosting and I also have a meetup in the evening. So I need something that can go from work to the club. Real quick, hence these pants. I have a different work from some of y'all, so I can wear these to work. Let's go. All right, so I have this faux leather halter giving you back that realness right there. Yes, super adorbs. And I'm wearing leggings. I'll explain in a second. 
Alright, so the reason I have leggings on is because these pants do not breathe at all. They're basically plastic. So you need that barrier between you and the plastic because it's just not a vibe otherwise. Also, when you have leggings on, it makes it a lot easier for you to pull them up. And I'm throwing on a black blazer because this Nairobi weather is giving more mixed messages than your ex-boyfriend on Valentine's Day. So there's that. And my heels of the day and my bag of the day. And voila. My full look of the day. So yeah, and this is the hair of the day. I also did a tutorial on that. So I don't know if I should throw... Have I done this tutorial before on YouTube? Okay, just in case, let me just throw it in. And then you can use that as a basis on how to do a pixie on a budget. So let's style a wig together. This is a pixie wig that I got off of Jumia for... 894 bulb, Nine, less than 900 bulb. Now, let's keep in mind, this is a wig that costs 800, well, 900. So we're not expecting it to be spectacular, but we're gonna style it to be magnificent. So I'm gonna style it into a great Gatsby vibe, and then I'm gonna side part this hair, like so, like that, and then we're just gonna brush it to the side. This is a part and what I'm going to do is take the black bobby pins and basically just tuck each bobby pin to hold this part back but also creating a wave. And then I'm going to keep this little swoop on the side because I think it's kind of vibes. Now I'm going to pin this side down with some gold pins that I got from Beauty Galore and also these super cute pearl pins that I also got from Jumia. And here we have it. My Great Gatsby moment and a thousand bulb. Mm. Bibes. Bibes! Bibes! Okay. It's a swoop for me. Ow. Um, yeah, so I'm getting ready for a quick interview, then we do the master class. Um, yeah. <laughs> and this is a wowsy team. Hi's. Hello's. <laughs> sat in that traffic for almost I'm, an hour and a half my legs are so tired we turned around and now we're eating somewhere else we genuinely tried like if you guys are watching imagine we tried yes yeah, absolutely like i i was also in the right place i'm so tired but the kenyan <laughs> traffic was also in the right place at the wrong time <laughs> so now we're at social house having dinner with my bae like what did i just want to play <laughs> here and work on the next one thank you guys so much for being here bye